Hey everybody, Maggie here with a basic look today at the Heidi Swap Mink machine. Now this machine is a foil applicating machine and what that means is it will take items that you would like to apply foil to and just by running them through this machine and using a little heat and a little pressure you will get beautifully foiled items. So let me take a quick rundown on exactly what the machine does. So here we have an on off button on the machine and a forward reverse button over here and I will show you in just a minute exactly how that forward and reverse works. We also have different heat settings on top of the machine from zero which is no heat at all to five which is the hottest that the machine runs. You get to those different heat settings by pressing this gold button. Now most of the things you will mink will use the three heat setting, but it's always a good idea to look at the individual things you are foiling uh, to make sure that you're using the proper heat setting. Sometimes you need more, sometimes you need less. Okay, so let's take a look at some of the things that you can mink and exactly how they work. So these are some tags that are designed specifically for the mink machine. Now you will see that on these tags, each one of them has areas of black here. When you buy something that is specifically designed to be used in the mink machine, in whatever area is black, that is where your foil will be applied. Now, the mink uh, works with toner, printer toner, so you can also print your own um, designs on a laser printer and then run those through the mink. So that the mink will react with this toner and it will apply foil to all of the areas that have toner on them. You can also see that there is this specialty mink paper. Now this is gonna be a little bit hard to see that you can use to foil as well. Yeah, this is even hard for me to see on here. These are little hearts. Now, I know you're just gonna have to trust me on this one, but each of these hearts will also react with the special foil that you use and they will become overlaid with foil. Really quick, let me give you a look at the kind of foil I'm talking about. This is special reactive foil that is used with the mink machine. And I'll give you a demonstration in just a second on exactly how you put something through the mink and then you'll see the results that we get. But just really quick, you'll see you put a piece of foil over whatever you would like to apply foil to, run it through the machine, and that's how you get your results. We'll do it with this piece of paper so you can see how it works. And we'll do a few tags too. Now, not only can you use the specifically designed um, items that were made specially for the mink. You can also create your own designs. Like I said, you can do it with the laser printer. You can also use some of Heidi's other products. Mink reactive paint, uh, texture paste. There's also some mink reactive mist and art screen ink. All of these are reactive with this foil. So if you create a project with any of these media, you can run that once it's completely dry through the machine and apply foil to whatever design you've created with these media. Heidi has also come out with some glue pens. So you can actually write with these glue pens Wait until the glue is dry, put the mink on top and run that through your machine and you'll also be able to get beautifully foiled designs using these glue pens, the machine, and some foil. All right, so I would like to show you exactly how this thing works. It's really neat. You're going to be amazed with the results. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. I have turned my machine on and to get to number three, I just press the gold button four times and it and you'll see there's a green button lit up under number three. This is the heat setting I'm going to use to foil these pieces of paper. I have my, my machine on forward. So what that means is that is going to pull my paper through the machine forward in order for it to be foiled. Now, 
sometimes there is occasion where you'll need to use the reverse machine say something gets a little caught up uh, you'll want to reverse your folder coming out so that nothing gets jammed up in the machine i have to say i think i've used the reverse maybe once stuff doesn't get jammed up in there if you pr put it in properly so it's just it's kind of just a precaution just in case okay so let's get ahead go ahead and foil these every time you use the machine you'll want to use one of these transfer folders now what this does is it protects not only the machine but everything else um other papers inside here uh um everything around you from either getting foil on it or from uh, transferring foil to other things or from getting jammed in in the machine you'll see that uh, it, things flow right through with this transfer folder and you'll just want to make sure you use this when you are running things through the machine okay so this is how we start we put our pieces in here with whatever is getting minked side up like this and then we're just going to place foil directly over the top now, it's a little bit counterintuitive that this is how we want to do it, but you do want to make sure that you place the foil so that the color side is up. We'll make sure there are no real big bubbles in there. And then with the folded side first, you put this right into the machine. And you'll be able to feel, because the rollers are constantly moving, when you put that in, the rollers will grab the end of the folder and will bring it through the machine. And then we just sit and wait a little minute while this goes through. Okay, so my folder has just gone all the way through the machine and now this is the fun part. You just open up the folder. You don't have to wait for anything to cool down or to dry or anything. You can just immediately open this up. And then you take the foil off, comes right off, and ta-da! You have this beautifully foiled. See, now you can see the hearts everywhere on here. And they're this beautiful teal foil. And the same with these tags. Wherever there was black on the tag before, now there is this beautiful teal foil. You can see that when it catches the light. The results really are astounding. And that's it. It's really not a difficult thing to use. Um, you just put your papers down, put the foil on top, run it right through the machine, and you're done. Thanks so much for taking a look today. And good luck. Hope you have a great time with your mink.